from Lily Synthetic Wigs. They very kindly sent me this wig to review and try on for you guys and see how I like it and I'm really really excited because this is a mint green wig and I've always wanted a mint green wig. Hence why I've done some mint green eyeshadow today to go with the theme. So the wig took about a week, just over a week to get to me. So the shipping was pretty quick on their end. They did provide a tracking number with this wig so that way I can keep track of the order and whereabouts it is and when it's coming to me. So that is all great. So this is the wig that I am reviewing today. I will put it on the screen so you can see it properly. But it's a beautiful mint green colour with like a rootage going on. And this is a lace front wig as well. I do prefer lace front wigs. I just, I think they look more natural and the best looking wigs that you can get. So I'm just going to go through some details about the wig with you guys. Classy mint ombre long straight synthetic hair lace front wig. This wig is called the Scarlet Wig, so I love the name of that. Originally, this is $70 for the wig, which I think is really good price, but at the minute it's on sale for $41, so that's so affordable. Lily Synthetic have kindly given my followers a $5 off for their entire order. So when you're at checkout, if you enter the code JESSICA05, that will take $5 off. Okay, so I am back and this is going to be the style portion of the video, so I'm going to show you how I can style the wig. So I might be going back and forth between clips to show you how to install the wig. I thought I would show you in a better lighting. So this is how long the wig is. It's very, very long. I'm going to go ahead and brush this. So I'm going to go ahead now and apply my wig cap. I feel like the skin tone version for me is going to look better and easier for blending. So I'm going to go ahead and pop this on. So I tightened it along the bottom here so it's nice and tight when I apply it. I've got two side clips and one middle clip here. I love the ombre on this wig. It's such a beautiful ombre. Absolutely beautiful. It's all one lunch, which I absolutely love in this wig really really thick and full of hair it's a really good quality wig so i have already gone ahead and cut the lace off this wig so i'm going to go ahead and insert that clip now so you can see what i did and how i did that so once you're happy with that hairline you can go ahead and cut it so you want to be careful with this part and go in with your scissors and start trimming trim right around the edge as neat as you can just to remove the lace and then this way, if you've got it in position, you know exactly where you want the wig to be. I'm going to bring it in a little bit more. Don't be afraid to cut more if you need to, because everyone's head shape is different. So now I can go ahead and do the other side. Okay, so I've gone ahead and plucked the middle parting here just so it makes it a little bit more wider and this is going to look more natural. So I brought it to about the middle of my head, so I think that looks the best. So what I'm doing now is I'm taking the middle clip of the wig and I'm going to pop this in the middle portion of my head. So wherever I want the centre part to be. So I'm going to pop it right here, just slide that in. Then I'm going to pick up the end of the wig here and then pull it round and then connect the side pieces. So I just grab the end, pull it round, tuck the hair underneath and whip it back and this is what it looks like so far. So I'm just going ahead now and brushing through the wig. So 
So at this stage, I'm gonna go ahead and take the side clip and just make sure that it is secure by pulling it down and under and then securing that in place. So this wig is now installed and I really, really love it. It's such a good quality wig. So soft, luxurious, thick folds. This is such a gorgeous colour. I've always wanted like this mint green wig. I'm just going to spray the hair and just flatten the frizz. Look how long this hair is. Wow. So long, silky and smooth. I'm absolutely in love with this. So now I'm going to show you how I would style this wig and how I would accessorise it as well. So I'm going to take a small thin piece of hair from the front and then throw the hair behind me and do the same on the other side. And then the rest of the hair throw behind. And then I'm going to take some hair from the side. I'm just brushing and smoothing down the top layer. And then right on top, I'm going to secure that with a ponytail. So I'm taking the hair from the ponytail and I'm going to wrap that around and create a loose, messy bun. Play around with it until you're happy with the shape. And then just place some bobby pins around the bun to secure that in place. And then in this side of the hair, I'm going to take a little section of hair from the top here like so and then just start braiding this as normal and then pick up some little bit pieces of hair and start gathering that in with the braid small pieces at a time make sure the hair is nice and smooth And then when I get to about halfway, I then stop gathering the hair. Then I do the rest as a normal plait, making sure to keep the hair and the ends nice and smooth. And then just secure the ends with a ponytail. Next I'm gonna take these little pieces at the front that I've gathered and brush through them. I'm just going to cut these a little bit to frame the face. So I feel like if they were like around here, feather them down a little bit and trim them. So with the other side, I'm going to gather that together so I know exactly where to cut. So they're both the same length. And then for some accessories, I'm going to put some pearl earrings in because I'm wearing a white top and I feel like mint and white looks really good together. I'm just going to go ahead and pop these earrings in. The white pearl earrings just look really good with the mint colour vibe. Next I would add some clips to the hair. I'm going to take these two little ones here. These are silver and blue. Anything like that sort of colour round would look really nice with this. And then at the front here on the side is where I'd want to clip that. And then I'm taking the blue clip and then clipping it on this side as well. And then lastly, to accentuate the bun on top of the head, I would add something like this. This is a really dainty little headpiece. It's blue flowers with some white little pearls. And it has a little comb on here, so I feel like this would look really pretty. I put it right in front of the bun and just push that into place. So this is how I would style up the wig if I was going out anywhere for a party, an occasion or anything like that. This wig definitely gives you some confidence, let me tell you that. So yeah, I'm really, really happy with that. I love how I did my hair and how I styled it. So this is just some helpful tips on what you can do with this wig as well or any other wigs from their website. Again, if you are interested in this wig, I will link it down below. So go ahead and check out the description box for the link for this wig. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give a big thumbs up. It really does help out my channel. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell notifications to be notified of all my future videos just like this one. Thanks guys for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye guys.